tonight. Voting will soon be underway in the upstate ahead of the upcoming presidential primary elections. Next year, South Carolinians will have a new way to vote. Our Stephanie Borman shows you how the new ballot machines will work. Vote for two if you want to. You don't have to. Amy Dixon tried out the new state voting machines on Sunday at Tabernacle Baptist Church. The NAACP chapter of Greenville invited the community to demo the new software. During the demo, voters selected their favorite vacation destinations and type of BBQ. Dixon says she was pleased with how user-friendly it was. I like it. I like the fact that we have a paper copy very much. And she wasn't the only one. Is it easy to use? Yes. Very easy. The biggest change, the new machines operate using a paper ballot. Voters will put those ballots into the new machines. After voters make their selection, the machine will print out the paper ballot. Voters then take the paper ballot, scan it, and formally submit their vote. According to the Greenville County Elections Commission, a verifiable paper trail is the one thing most voters have pushed for. So that they could look at who they voted for and have a chance to audit that against an electronic system. The Elections Commission plans to audit the system regularly. We will take these and we will random sample a number of precincts and go back and hand count and compare it against the machine to make sure they're doing what they're supposed to. Dixon tells 7 News that will eliminate all doubt about election fraud. A paper copy, we can go back to it. It is, well, now it's not as, as easily Contaminate, and that was our Stephanie Borman reporting. The director of elections says come November 5th, Greenville County voters will be using these machines to elect their next city leaders.